Right, I'm back out on the fields. There's Mark and uh, Clive, and we're gonna find some treasure. Oh, I got a banging one here. High number. Got a glove on today because I stubbed one of my fingers yesterday. It's a bit sore. So I need one glove. <laughs> oh, banging. Banging signal just here. Oh, what's that? Yeah. Uh, it is a good big piece of bronze. Of a tractor. Uh, it's a big piece of bronze. Uh, pass? What do you suppose it is? Got a big piece of bronze. Oh, have I got a toothbrush with me? I'm not sure I have. Be something really ancient. Right, on to the next. Oh, we got another one here. Ooh, nice high number. Oh, I think it's still in there. Oh, there it is. Another lump of bronze. Oh no. It's an ox knob. We've got an ox knob. Oh, big slits in this one. Good big slits. Very deep, like cuts. I think that's how they sort of get them hot. They put some sort of clamp on there and they sort of screw it on hot. Clegg has found his knob. On to the next. Ooh, I've got something down here. Bang it. Oh, oh, stub me finger. It's a little bit sore. Right there. Must be space gone. Always put it behind me. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, I don't want a bunch. What's up there? Yeah. Ooh. Is that it? Or is that the impression? No, that's the impression. That's the coin. Oh, I've got a coin. Uh, uh, ooh, what's that on there? It's a bit odd. Was that just corrosion? I'll let that dry up a bit. A bit of a rubber dub. And uh, we'll see what's on there. Oh. There she blows, it's a Hibernia, an Irish coin. There's a harp and a crown on the top. This side's much worse. Ah, just about to see King George III. So it's a King George III Hibernia. Oh, I reckon I got something down here. Hmm, don't know. Mm, biggish signal. Biggish. Ah. Ah, is it a good big nut? It is a good big one. <laughs> Said it sounded khaki. Ah, it's driving me nuts. Oh, this is what Mark's found. He's found a nice 1500s buckle and a coin. Right, we'll get that cleaned what up. What I've found so far. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get that cleaned up and we'll get back to you. We've had a bit of a clean up and it looks a bit strange, look. It's got like a square thing in the middle and then an outer band with some writing on it. Can't quite make out the writing. And on this side, 
it's got like an animal with very long legs, like a giraffe, which is a bit strange. <laughs> it's got that bar at the bottom, like you, where you'd have the date, but you can't see anything. So that is probably the, one of the weirdest, got to be a token or something. Maybe it's a, it's a token to get in the zoo. <laughs> it's a zoo token. Yeah, it might, might well be. And that's the cages yeah. the animals are in. I'll put it in here and we'll have a look later. Oh, I've got something down this here hole. Oh, get rid of the dissected worm. And the other bit. Oh, and a bit more. <laughs> oh. That's a banging signal. Yeah, it's on. Deeper then. Oh no! Guess what it is, Mark? Oh no, not a tubus moors. It's a tubus moors. Oh, I just had another art breaker. Tiny little button, silver washed button. Yeah, shankless. I reckon there's Ahmed's on here somewhere. Oh, we've got something right here. Right there. Oh, I can see it. Is it a pesky button? Oh, it is. It's a pesky button. Anything on it? Nope. Just a plain boring squashed shank pesky button. Ugh. I think it's still down there. See down there? Oh, not really. Right, let's get you over the other side a bit. Right there. It's a bit of a keen breeze today. Oh, I can see it. I can see it. It looks coinish. Oh, not another pesky button. Another one. <laughs> yeah. ah. Ooh, did I feel a bump? Before I felt something. It's got a funny edge. It's all like crimped. Let's try and get you out of the wind. It's got like a crimped edge. Let's give it a rub on the magic trousers. Oh. Oh. Right. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, that's made it worse. Well, let's give it another rub off the magic trousers. If I could see something on there. I think it's just corrosion, but it's got a funny edge. On to the next. Oh, we've got a banging one here. Oh, 1246. Could be silver. Mm, a bit shallow. What's that there? That is a bulb, I think. Yeah, it's a bulb. It's a plant. Right there. Oh, oh, it's hit the move round for you. Oh, it's a bit off that. Let's get down you are. It's shallow for a coin, I think. Oh, saying that, I just touched something. Ah, oh, 
<laughs> yep, someone's been playing here and dropping their two pence spendables. Ugh. Oh, they sound lovely. On to the next. Oh, that sounds quite nice. That sounds coinish. Doesn't sound like a two pence, they're a lot higher. Well, so it might be a one pence. Get <laughs> oh. oh. speed in there. Oh, what's that? Is it a bit of cack? Oh, it's a good big lump of lead. A good big lumpo. Yeah, it's got to be at least a few ounces. Oh, I knew it was going to be a good idea coming down to the house, or near the house, because I think I've just found a hammered. I think. I think it's a hammered. Right, let's uh, let's get a better look on it. Hammered! Woohoo! Just let everyone else know. <laughs> I think. I think it's a hammered. Let's get my gloves off. Yeah, I think it is. Just a bit of a wasted one. Yeah, it's a wasted hammy. <laughs> right, I'm going to try and get this cleaned up and I'll get back to you. But it's been knocked around a lot. And uh, I can just see the rim just there. You see it? See the little rim in there? So I've got a wasted hammy, woohoo! <laughs> Mark will be pleased. Yeah, I've managed to clean it up a little bit. You can see a shield on there. And on that side, you can just see the dots going around the edge. I can see a B, a letter B, that's about it. So that's a hammered coin. I'd say from the size, I'd go with Elizabeth the first penny. Lovely jubbly. Let's see if we can find some more. Woohoo!